Hi there, this is Jeff from jeffmobile.com. Today I'm going to do a quick video for you guys about a new blog post that Roland UK did about their new synthesizer, the Roland Gaia SH-01. They recently released what they said was going to be 15 classic synth sounds. But what they have actually done is they've released about probably about 64 classic synth sounds which I'm going to show you how you can access these sounds and play them on your Roland Gaia. If you look over here at the screen, I've got the Roland UK blog here, and the address is this, Roland UK blog slash recreate dash 15 dash iconic dash synth dash sounds. And if you scroll down on this page, well, they, first of all, they've, what they've done is they've linked together 15 classic YouTube videos of synthesizer music ranging from Daft Punk, Deadmau5, MGMT, Europe, The Final Countdown, Van Halen, Jamiroquai, Faithless, Skillrex, all these great bands and all these classic synthesizer sounds, even Owl City Fireflies there. And they've provided a link to a workshop that they're putting on in England Great Britain about how to recreate these sounds using your synthesizer. But recently I commented on their post and they've they said download our 15 iconic synth sounds patch for free. Just save it to a USB stick and load it into your synth. So I did that and I actually discovered a most amazing thing. So this is the synthesizer, the Roland Gaia SH01. And at the back of the synthesizer, you can plug in a USB stick, which I've done there, it's USB memory. I loaded in the sounds that Roland provided and I discovered a large number of really great sounds, which I'm going to demonstrate to you right now. So this synthesizer, if you push the USB memory patch button here, you can access this, the patches on the USB stick. And I'm going to load up bank A, which is already on bank A. And I'm just going to play a bunch of these sounds. There's actually 64 sounds that they've provided in this Roland patch. They actually said they only patch just provides 15, but I guess on the synth that they used to load these sounds, they actually had a whole bunch of other cool sounds on that synth. So. So bank A number one is a nice sort of rich synthesizer bass sound and it can also be used for pads. Of course, all of these sounds you can modify by changing all the parameters here. It's pretty much endless. You can also turn off some of the tones. So just the first tone Kind of a raspy uh, sawtooth wave. And then if we turn on the second tone, another tone, another sawtooth wave that's being added there. And by layering all these sounds, you get a really rich sound. So that's just the first sound that they provided. And if you go into the computer, you can go into what's called the Roland Gaia tool. It's not provided by Roland, it's the Roland Gaia SH01 tool. And you can actually see what sounds are in the patch. So if you go to this reload button here, reload the patch, it tells you what's in the tone. So our tone number one is a sawtooth with some filter envelope amp. So it tells you everything about this sound. It's pretty neat. And you notice that the um, oscillators are being detuned. So tone one is detuned is nine, tone two is detuned six, and tone two, three is detuned minus 15. So that gives it that chorus kind of rich patch sound. So that's just the first tone. I'm gonna play a couple more tones to give you the idea. So bank A number two sounds like this. 
So if we come over to our Roland Gaia tool here, we can see what that sound is created like. It's based on a saw wave and a square wave. I've clicked on tone one, I get a saw, and tone two, I get a square. And tone one is a different pitch. So oscillator is pitch is 12 and pitch is zero. So if I play that, just tone one, I get this. And tone two, I get this. That's tone one and tone two. Sounds like this. So you can tell by 12 semitones, they're actually one octave apart because each octave has 12 semitones. You can also kind of compare them here. Other than that, they're pretty much the same. The attack time is different on the filter envelope. And they have a different sustain on the amp. It's cool. So yeah, this, this Roland Gaia tool is a really good tool for analyzing patches. All right, so I've only explored two of these 15 sounds that Roland provided. And there's actually around 64 sounds they provided. So in the coming days, I'm gonna explore some more of these sounds with you. So please check back on my channel jeffmobile.com and on YouTube at jeffmobile with a G for more videos about Roland Gaia synthesizers and the most amazing things you can do with it these days. So I think, personally, I think Roland Gaia synthesizers are going to become kind of like the Stradivarius or the, the Stratocaster of modern music because there's such a affordable instrument. You can get one from between $300 and $600 and they're incredibly powerful. Even Lady Gaga uses two of them on stage and Owl City uses it and everyone like that uses them so I think they're a wonderful instrument and I look forward to exploring my Roland Gaia with everyone here on YouTube more in the future and I'll talk to you later. Bye!